Hey guys, um, I haven't had a video in a while, but I figured I would do an update on some of the items I've picked up and um, the prices that I paid. Um, first, I went to a coin auction. Actually, it was online, but it was in my local town. But I wasn't able to attend, so I just bought them online. Um, but a pretty good coin auction and bought a America the Beautiful Mount Hood 2010 um, ATV 5 ounce coin for $110 yes $110 in beautiful condition it's a um, as I say, MS-69. And then also, I bought the Yellowstone. 2010, MS-69. It's the same auction for 110 which is killer prices. I'm actually mad at myself that I, don't, I didn't have more money at the time, because... And you guys would die, but they're the first 18 coins of the of the Kookaburra series um, actually sold for $375, which is unreal. And then I also picked this up at an auction, an 1890 Morgan dollar that's made into a money clip, which I think is pretty cool because... Um, That's usually what I carry my money around is a money clip. Um, also, picked up a National Champions from my local coin shop. National Champions, 1987 Indiana um, one ounce silver coin. Which, if you guys know college basketball or college sports in general, um, Indiana and Purdue are very big rivals. And I, I actually go to Purdue, so the guy at the coin shop thought I was going to melt it down. Um, but then he ended up going into his back shelf and selling me this, which is a one ounce Silvertown Purdue University Boilermakers. There's the Purdue's, kind of like their emblem, I don't really know what it is, but, um, but I thought that was awesome. He sold that to me for 20 bucks, which is my favorite buy one of my favorite buys so far also at the same at auction I was at I bought 391 grams of 40% silver that's like this for 10 bucks I tried to do a little bit of calculation but I'm pretty sure it's about $70 worth of silver um, also, I picked up a one Troy ounce silver trade unit. Um, I love the black on this. I know a lot of people like the shiny, but on this coin, I think the black looks awesome. I love the tarnishing. Um, also, I picked up this, the proof, 1966. It's from Ireland. Um, it's a pretty cool coin. Might sell it. I don't know. Oh, and then I also got another 1806 um, 8 Real. Um, this one I I think is in awesome shape. Got a great deal on it as well. Beautiful shape. Um, and it is real. I have checked and verified it. Oh, also, this is a very cool coin. I. I just received from Of The Earth because he won my birthday contest and was kind enough to send me back another ounce of silver. And it is silver trade unit. And then it has a panda on it. Which is awesome. I love love it. I think it's a great coin. It was very, very nice of him to send something back when he didn't need to. So thanks Of The Earth. Um, also, I picked up at the same auction. I picked up um, t 
two, two, um, ninety percenters for twelve bucks, which I didn't think is too bad. Not too bad. I also started started on a roll of War Nickels. Finished a roll of Mercury Dimes at this auction too, by the way, because they they went pretty cheap. Started another roll of Mercury Dimes. Um, this is my only roll that I've started of Roosevelt's. Got a little bit to go on those. Also picked up three three quarters from my local coin shop. This one is a 1964. And then luckily a guy had just brought a whole bunch of stuff in and I picked up a 1959. Beautiful condition. Beautiful. I maybe a proof. And I know this one for sure is a proof. And it's a 1959 as well. And it is absolutely gorgeous. I about died when I saw him in his bag or in his 90%. And also, thanks to MCQ02, I made a trade with him and was able to um, I'm not gonna be able to get this in to pick it up. I was actually able to um, so far catch up on all the coins, but I did trade him a couple ounces of silver for the Neiman Lion, which great coin. Um, my girlfriend got me the five ounce. 12 labors of Hercules ground and the box. And then I ended up picking up the rest of them. The mares. I already had the bull. Picked up the birds and the stables. Fine. So, yeah, that's, that's all I have right now. Um, I, I do have two... Uh, Sorry, give me a second to set this back up. This is just my iPhone, so. I do have a couple auctions I will be attending soon, and I also have two Silver Slacker um, skulls coming in. One for me and one for Prospect Prospector Stone. That I will be making a trade with him. For some of his um, Australian prospector rounds. He has a great channel. You guys should go check him out. He's new to the whole community as well. Um, I'll try to put a link in the in the description. If I remember. And. I believe that is it. Um, if you guys can. Go check out my other video. I have some foreign coins. I need help identifying. Um, other than that. I think I've caught you guys up on everything I got. Um, yep, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. And like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.